Hi everybody, in this video I'm going to walk you through how to get those uh, zip folder parts that I created and put on um, Canvas for you into Fusion 360. It's pretty simple, you can see here I've downloaded it already. Here is the zip folder. I am on a Windows machine, but your, mach your process will be pretty much the same. Um, the problem is that this is a zip folder, which means it's compressed and um, the, the computer right now considers that to be one file with a bunch of compressed parts inside of it. And so in order to use this, we have to first extract it. Okay, so the process MacBook, Windows, it's all the same. You're going to extract the parts. I'm going to click extract here on a Windows machine. That's how, how easy it is on a Windows machine. And now I have a folder that does not have that little zipper on it anymore. It's not zipped. And if I open that up, now I can see, I guess it's a couple layers deep, but there are five parts inside of here. Okay, so what I want to do then is click Upload in Fusion 360. I can either go select files and find those five, or over here I can either drag and drop them. Okay, and it says that there are five IPT files, Inventor Part Files, and that's exactly what I want. Notice that the location is inside of 4.5 cams in motion. That's exactly where we want it. If you need to go through and change location, you can do that. Okay, but we're not going to do that. I'm going to click Upload. It's going to upload, and I'm going to have all of those parts now, whenever this finishes, inside of Fusion 360 and ready to use. Okay, so that's the first thing you need to do. I'm going to cut the video off here. Next video, I'm going to show you how to start assembling then this particular object, the automata object.